You're listening to the Amazing Facts Daily Devotional. Today's topic, the ultimate tree of life. One tree can absorb as much carbon dioxide in a year as an automobile creates driving 26,000 miles. The longest living organism on our planet is the tree. It is also one of the greatest natural resources we have. Trees help to keep our air clean. Just one tree can produce about 260 pounds of clean oxygen per year. Over the course of its life, a tree can absorb about one ton of carbon dioxide. An acre of trees can remove 2.6 tons of carbon dioxide in a year. Trees benefit us in many other ways. If they are well maintained, trees can increase our property value and the soil quality. Properly placed trees around buildings can reduce air conditioning needs by 30%. Wind buffering provided by trees can also lower our heating bills in the winter. Of course, I could talk about lumber and paper products we get from trees, along with fruit to feed our families. Our text for this evening says, The fruit of righteousness is a tree of life, Proverbs 11.30. People who live according to the wisdom and knowledge of God are a nurturing blessing to others. Their conduct and words bring life, healing, and encouragement to those around them. Perhaps you've been next to someone who drains you, someone who is usually focused on himself and only wants to get from others. On the other hand, some folks seem to inspire you when you're in their company. Their presence lifts you and gives you energy, much like the tree of life in the Garden of Eden. People who live according to God's laws are a gift of life to those close by. Jesus was like this. When men, women, and children were close to Christ, they were transformed, and others could tell. When Peter and John were arrested for preaching about Jesus, they were brought before the Sanhedrin and questioned. The disciples spoke so courageously about the Lord that the Bible says of the Jewish rulers, Now when they saw the boldness of Peter and John and perceived that they were uneducated and untrained men, they marveled, and they realized that they had been with Jesus. Acts 4.13 We win souls by reflecting Jesus to others. The wisest thing we can do is lead others to the cross of Christ, which is the ultimate tree of life. Our key Bible text today comes from Proverbs chapter 11 and verse 30. The fruit of righteousness is a tree of life, and he that winneth souls is wise. Thank you for listening to the Amazing Facts Daily Devotional.